Peace. Like, comment, subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> Dragon Ball Z? Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z. Dragon Ball and no. Dragon Ball. At the same, they started roughly around the same. Wait, wait. Am I tripping? Nineteen ninety nine Dragon Ball. No, they started earlier. Dragon Ball. Okay. Started Anyways, nineteen ninety nine Dragon Ball. Nineteen ninety nine. One like Piece. One no. Piece is way. Ahead. No, way I think ahead. Dragon Ball Z probably started in like nineteen ninety nine. Dragon Ball. Oh, two thousand two like, was. Or like nineteen ninety six. I think started, is when Dragon Ball Z started. Ooh. Dragon Ball started nineteen ninety three, nineteen ninety four. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Dragon Ball Z is probably in 1999. Yeah, they were before them, and like, bro, content quality is just because a lot of the it's way better. A lot no, of it's the, not. Bro. One Piece almost started out like a show they thought wasn't gonna make it. No, cause and he, then like it randomly they like got a bunch of funding and started true. making it good. You're Naruto's, tripping, bro. Like the and beginning of it is like handmade, bro. Duh, that's how animation was back then. All right, what were we saying? Naruto. Uh, nobody cares about Naruto. Naruto. No, I was saying Naruto's and One Piece's creator were both inspired by the Dragon Ball characters. Yeah, yeah. The and they did it back like you LeBron. Could tell. Like LeBron. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You could be inspired by like I'm not not yeah. It's one of the greats, you know. Yeah, but I would say what quality about One Piece? Okay, you take out. Are you talking about pre time skip you take or out after? Vegeta, you take out Goku, right? That leaves you with Piccolo, Gohan. Right, I don't know. Gohan, they kind of what? Yeah, right Gohan, now. they hella fucked Gohan. What are you talking about? Just I'm saying it, it's not even the Z fighter. Do, do not appreciate Gohan to say that like, oh, he just fucked off now. Like, yeah. He's ruined. What are you is talking about? Crazy, bro. As much as Gohan what? went through the whole series, just because now he's grown up and retired, like that's that's no. He you still have meant, to appreciate bro, the through him throughout the whole series. Okay, the Z fighters were supposed to be like this whole shit. They just gave up on them, bro. Like no, they, they couldn't catch up. They gave up, bro. Fucking Super Saiyan Blue, Goku went against Krillin. <laughs> when? Oh when, no, I remember before, that. Yeah, yeah, he whooped bro. his ass. Okay, bro, but there was in no way, shape, or form should Krillin be able to even take a single punch from them. No, they bro, don't have a Krillin fight. been working, bro. And plus, you're talking about hella bro, late. He said Dragon he Ball Z. wasn't like, working out, bro. He, what are you talking about, bro? You still didn't name the qualities about One Piece that you. No, the character over. development and backstory. Frieza's evil because that's he, Frieza. He, that's Frieza. Yeah, Cell that, that is the same. Is, that is something, that is the something same I said. I didn't like. Cell is the same way. Cell was made in a lab. Okay, bro. Cell was made in a lab, made right, out of fucking, Piccolo, Goku, and like all. Okay, like, and then he and was who? made by Captain Jerome, who was the evil scientist who was evil. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Jerome? <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure that's his it, name. No. Yeah, Dr. Jerome. <laughs> Jerome? Is, is he actually saying that? Jerome. Nah, bro, Jerome. It's not Jerome, bro. <laughs> no, Jerome, bro. <laughs> Forget a ball fade yeah. and shit. <laughs> Captain Jerome. It's no, ca Captain no. Jerome. No, nah, bro, I'll look it up. You can look at it. Jerome is wild as hell, bro. Especially how you dress is crazy. Y'all remember uh, Jerome? Dr. Yeah. Jerome. Dr. Jerome. <laughs> better villains. Better backstories for each Better character. villains. What villains, bro? Other than Doe Flamingo? Like, what are you talking about? Who's the better villain? That, like, Name the villains, please. Kaido's a fantastic villain, bro. Black He's bare, Why is he evil, bro? They I don't know yet. Why evil, bro? I just met him. Oh, wait. And he, he is, hasn't really is, done shit. No, he is a other fantastic Other than be a giant bro. boar. Yes, bro. He's no, he's exactly, just bro. evil. There's bro. also Blackbeard. Big like, Mom is what, bro? She's hella cool. Big Mom's soul ability is cool. I don't. I didn't watch it, bro. So I might just be over here. What are you talking about? That's like the second the strongest fucking, bitch. The fucking uh, like the admiral, trauma. not the admiral. The, the, yeah, she has child, childhood no, trauma, bro. That's her. The fuck? Her adopted mom. Died. What's what's uh, a kainu? It's not a kainu. A kainu. Who's a lava dude? That's a kainu. Yeah, he was fuck. He's a terrible fucking guy. No, he's just a piece of shit. Yeah, he's a piece of shit. But where, what's villain. his origin? He's Amazing not a, villain. He's not a villain because in. He's in their villain. in their way, it's justice because he's a marine. Even then, the world government being this mysterious shit, bro, where they have fucking bro. But he's a puppet because you don't you don't know how we don't know how much he knows right now. Kaido isn't better than Boo, bro. Kaido is, isn't better than. Boo, I would put bro. Kaido to be the same as Cell, actually. Like they're like like them perfecting themselves, right, and having like this lust for battle, you know, wanting to be proven. Yeah. Like I find it, but I think how Kaido had the fucking like the. Turn Wano into a fucking factory for his weapons and shit like yeah. that was fucking evil. Yeah, like in the Laughing Fruit and how he had been working with other fucking. It was. It felt like, like a little less him and more of that little weird dude under him. 
No, no. It was like the it factory was shit, it was bro. Stupid it was like, him, bro. It was stupid him, bro. He just doesn't seem smart, bro. He only used the dude under him, so he could he could get all the land. And yeah. Water. Why? Why would he need him? To get more people support, just to have so like a local person. You know? Yeah. I think it's kind of like how like there are certain like flags that show, hey, this warlord protects this area or this emperor protects this area. I think it's more just establishing ground. You know what I mean? It's like, hey, we're going to work together. I'm going to get this half of the island. You get that half. I mean, yeah, I guess he could have just fucking demolished everything. But that's not evil enough, bro. You got to poison the water, bro. <laughs> you got to make this the girl, water supply. You got to make this girl fucking <laughs> eat rice once a year, bro. Yeah. Like, that shit is fucking evil, yeah. bro. It's not even clean rice. It's poisonous. Yeah. She's got to make this little girl. Drink, yeah, exactly. Drink poisonous water and yeah. eat a grain. Oh, the smile fruit was disgusting, bro. That was a crazy. The, the oh, smile it makes fruit. you smile? Yeah, that shit that was weird. evil, bro. That was weird. That's fuck. You can't control it. Yeah. Bro. Android 18 and 17. I mean, bro. Goku hit his head. We're innocent teens, bro. Goku hit his head. He's a fucking idiot. Like he didn't. What do you mean he hit outside. his head? As a baby? Yeah. How is he an idiot? No, he's just actually an idiot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What is Luffy? No, Luffy is like, he's stupid. Uh, you're going to say he's, he's not foolish. an idiot, bro? He's foolish. No, I think he, bro, he sped run from, bro, he's been on the seas for three years, bro. But none okay. of that is how, without without Nami or any of that, he would be lost or drowned. Okay, but he would Goku literally without, be lost and drowned. Goku without Dragon Balls would be dead. No, Goku without Boma would be no. He'd there be you a go. Boma on the there street, you go. That's a good point. No, he Boma would be in the forest. And he would, first of all, he doesn't need any of those things. He doesn't. He literally needed them, he bro. He does not need. He them. literally right, without Boma, there's, there's no time against, travel. Without he, Boma, there's no time travel. There's no trunks or anything like that. He needed her a yeah. lot. He did not. <laughs> he did not need Boma. He bro, literally. You needed need Boma. your whole squad, bro. What are you or talking you're about? Fucked. Anyway, so we're still talking about villains. It also, this nigga away, died like forty times between... and only lives off of what, bro? Who? Why is Luffy still alive, bro? Do you not see a after Dragon. his fight with Crocodile? Dragon. Dragon saved him. For sure. It, with Crocodile? Wait, wait, no, 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 the execution. Luffy I'm talking about Crocodile. Because Luffy with Robin? was super resilient. What happened with Crocodile, huh? When he drowned him in the fucking yep. sand. Yeah, he got saved by Robin. Okay. <laughs> no, he, did he? Since, yeah, he got yeah, saved yeah, by he Robin. Got saved yeah. Robin. Yeah. But, bro, for what? Like, Because like, Robin was using him to her own ends during that time, so. Yep. So without Robin. He died like three times in that, and then came back. The amount of times Luffy has probably been near death experience. In the show, it's, it's a probably a lot. A ridiculous yeah. and then he's, I mean, it has to happen. It's character development. You know what I mean? <laughs> no. <laughs> I would say that yeah, knocked out by Kyle Goku is stupid the because battle. he could have easily killed Majin Buu, but Fat Buu, if he would have just turned Super Saiyan, he could have easily killed him, right? But he was like, oh no, he was setting his ways. He was like, the generation beneath me has to fight their own battles and shit, so I'm not going to fucking do it. He thought Gotenks would be strong enough to fucking fight fucking one of the most evilest fucking villains of all time in their timeline. I think the difference between right, Dragon Ball bro. villains and One Piece villains is that One Piece villains usually all have an agenda. Yeah. And then it comes to Dragon Ball villains, it's just... Frieza has Kill an everyone. <laughs> no. Get that monkey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. Frieza's agenda. No, bro, they have agendas. Like, there's a lot of villains, bro. No, it's not. Half of it's either... No, it's not. Either, it half no, of it's either not. They had to bring back Frieza. Half yeah, of it's destroying it. humanity... Or taking it over, and that's it from what I've seen in Dragon Literally, Ball. Literally, bro. Like, that's all I've Literally. seen. But at least, like, in One Piece, it's not, like, all world conquest besides the government. But at least, yeah. like, Kaido, he was, he Broly. took over Wano because he was planning some sort of conquest for it. And then you had to Well, actually, Broly I don't know if we're going, going original Broly or, old, or new Broly. Uh, I mean, I, I wouldn't go. Original Broly is just brain controlled by a uh, salty Saiyan. Yeah. He wants to come back, and then also he was just, like mentally fucked with by Goku. Yeah, because he was crying a lot. <laughs> that part Goku's was a fucking bully. That part bro. was, crazy. That was yeah. crazy, but yeah. that shit was raw as hell. Yeah, because he was pissed, bro. It's fucked. Yeah. yeah, but you have a dude with like music powers, bro. <laughs> and the be yeah. beat him to like cover your ears, <laughs> and if you hear the beat, then it cuts you. Slash. You talking about the wiggly arm dude? No, he's like piano T. He's, he's like, trying about, to get groovy. He's talking about the yeah, long arms dude. Yeah, the long arms dude. Yeah. yeah. Chicka chow. Like yeah. That dude, yeah, yeah. So I, fucking everybody hates him. Bro. Dude, yeah. bro. I'm glad everybody he did him. not get the screen time he deserved. <laughs> it's annoying yeah. as fuck. Yeah. Villa, yeah, yeah, the emperors. But the emperors are kind of weak outside of Kaido. 
Are you dumb? What do you mean outside of Kaido? Outside of Kaido, they're kind of weak, bro. Character wise, like, you like you know Shanks not, is dude. barely in the show. That's Red like, Mom that's is okay. not a uh, Red Mom. Red Big Mom, Mom is not cool, bro. You don't. Not, you didn't even bro. watch her shit, bro. She's not yeah, a cool yeah, villain, yeah. bro. No, I get, but to say like these are the most powerful people in their world, and you're saying they're washed up. Besides no, they like I'm saying as characters though. Do you not like, they're not like Shanks that cool. stopped Kaido from coming Marine Ford, right? Yeah. No. I don't know that. And that's yeah. a whole thing. Shanks, when did that? Um, yeah, it was because when Shanks showed up said. after Ace died, he was yeah. like, "Oh, he just got dope fighting Kaido or some shit like that." Like they had just beef or something. Oh, they shit. just said it. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's not like they actually had a fight, bro. Come on now. They didn't show a fight, but they said that. Wow, what, what is Shanks doing here? He should have been on the red line with Kaido. Yeah, and they stopped because Kaido was supposed to come Marine Ford, and Shanks stopped him from coming, and then Shanks came to Marine Ford. And stop the whole war by saying if anyone wants to fight, yeah, come get his hands. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that shows pretty cool. If Kaido he didn't came, do nothing, bro. Crocodile, I've dude, never dude, seen is, Shanks was pretty cool, do though. nothing, bro. Crocodile was. Bro, I seen yeah, him stare cool. down like the giant snake thing outside of that, bro. It, it should be heavily changed. hinted at throughout the show of how much of a badass he is. Yeah, it's one, heavily, Mihawk, heavily hinted. on Because what that. Mihawk, the greatest swordsman on earth. Used to duel him when he had his other arm yeah. all the time, and now yeah. he's just like, I don't want to duel you because you don't. You're or not that even, full power. or even the fucking the wood admiral, right? The one that just came. Wait, no, stop. Wait, that's spoiler. It's not spoiler. Yes, it is. I don't know who that is. That's spoiler. He's still I'm not caught up. Getting older. Yeah. What do you mean? Who's getting older? He's still getting. I'm, I'm, he's still I'm right when Momonosuke grows up. Right when he grows up. Yeah. How many episodes is that? He's like twenty episodes, ain't he? That's from when he grows up. Yeah. No, no. When he literally becomes an adult dragon, yeah. he transforms into. Oh, an you adult. were just there. Yeah. Yeah. What the fuck? You're literally about yeah. to fucking. Dude, I, don't know I thought I thought this dude was fucking. I'm. I'm. I, I don't know, bro. You confuse me, bro. You need to catch up. No, I stopped when I, they stopped I, I doing the dub. Up, I was about to say, like up. literally, bro. You don't even have to. Yeah, yeah. You don't have to question it, brother. <laughs> well, that was just a fucking spoiler. Yeah. Right? I don't like, know what he's talking about. At all. Okay, good. First form cell was wicked as fuck, bro. Oh, that shit, bro. He's sucking people up, and, and shit. nobody knew where the fuck. Oh, he, he was, was going at. through the city. Yes, oh, bro, yeah, that shit was bro. treacherous, bro. Come on, bro. Like that shit was evil. And when as he hell, was like, dude. "Piccolo, <laughs> yeah. I'm your brother." Me and Kevin were like, "What?" Yeah, bro. he came yeah. from Namek. Vegeta was a villain. Yeah, yeah, Piccolo I guess. Was a villain bro, he also. was a fire villain when he came. With yeah, Nappa yeah. too. Yeah, that, he said, "Fuck, they had don't the, touch yeah. me." Yeah, and he killed Nappa. He killed Nappa. Bro, he was a fire Weak villain. Ass. So fire. Yeah, or when he fucking yeah, like so. like need Gohan in the stomach and shit. That shit was. Oh you know, yeah. Dynamic. He was and like, he fucking we're punched kind his own of kid. like <laughs> brothers. <laughs> no. I was like, that's pretty Hard. crazy. Yeah. Cap- okay, the Ginyu Force, bro, Captain Ginyu. Captain they Ginyu. were some erotic yeah. ass niggas, bro. Yeah, they were. It was crazy. Ass, yeah. That's an erotic. That's pretty, yeah. I look at them like how I looked at Doflamingo's dudes. Like I like those dudes. No, no I wouldn't look Del at them the same. Family? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I wouldn't look at those the same, but I see what you mean. <laughs> I don't like them as much, but like I guess the comparison. The Guinea Force or the family? Uh, I don't like the Guinea Force as much as the family. I find the Guinea Force slightly annoying. Who the fuck <laughs> is the family? Doflamingo's family. Yeah, that's like, like his, his celestial like, parts, or what are you talking no. about? No, they, are you like talking a, about like the dude with like the spring, gang. spring fruit, and then like they're the all trying to be in the future and the, shit. The, he was, remember he didn't watch what? it, but to describe it, it's like Doflamingo's yeah. family is like a mob family. Yeah, right? yeah. Oh, that's why I call it. Yeah, the but they were like obsessed with like the future or some shit like that. No. Like a new era is coming or some shit. No. Yes, they were. Yes, they were. How are you gonna say that and you didn't watch? But that was just one, no. That was just the one dude who joined Doflamingo's family at the end because he tricked Doflamingo. Tricked that guy though. The spring dude. I forget his name. Uh, yeah. Like Bella, 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 Bellamy, yeah. Bellamy. Bellamy. Yeah, there you go. Sure. Bellamy, yeah. But yeah, he tricked him. He didn't oh, really want him on the team. Oh really? Yeah. That was crazy. Why did he trick him? Cooler was because hard as hell. Using people. Ah, uh, that's crazy. You know, like one part of the whole fucking arc was Doflamingo uses puppet strings and made uh, the king slaughter his own people and then framed that's down the evil. king. That's evil. That's evil, bro. What? That's what I mean by. Like, oh yeah, that's just evil. That's yeah. shit. Okay. Doflamingo was a fire villain. So for like, I think like that's like the be- no. I said he was the best villain. Oh, okay. So like, like in One Piece, Doflamingo is for sure the best villain. Yeah. He's evil as fuck. So for like Kaido is pretty good so far. Kaido's kid. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so for 20 years, people thought the king or is it just the fucking madman who went on yeah. the mm-hmm. And then the truth came out. Never that shit was like, sad, You're bro. the best king. Yeah. We're sorry. I thought the fucking, uh, 
the Odin shit was kind of sad. Yeah. Like, he played a fool the whole time. Everybody's like, look at him. Oh, yeah. Fucking dumbass. Yeah, he just had the deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like, yeah, I thought that shit was like, I was like, damn. Yeah, hold on. Should always be cooked or some shit like that. <laughs> I don't know what he said, but yeah. that shit hurt back then. Uh, he's One Piece versus DBZ. <laughs> Nobody asked, literally. <laughs> What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the Flybug Podcast. We have been talking for 20 minutes. This is the first time y'all seeing us. Um, What's today? February 10th. It was my birthday nine days ago, and nobody says shit, by the way. Nobody told the viewers. I don't think you guys said happy birthday, thinking about it now. I think we're recording on your birthday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we didn't even mention it. Nobody gave a shit, bro. <laughs> we didn't nobody. mention it on the show. Anyways, happy late yeah. birthday to me. Um, I'm joined by the best. I guess he used to be the best. I'm joined by the host of the Flybook. The biggest, bestest host of the Flybook Podcast. Sincere, the host of the Flybook Podcast. And we got HR in the building. HR, yeah. Oh shit! In nice. my New Year's outfit. Whoa, Overcast. whoa! Is that brand new merch from Flybo? <laughs> no, it's not yet. <laughs> not yet. That should be pretty cool. No, I would say you should you should show them more of your. Uh, I'll do it later. Uh, sure. what's it called? Komodo. No, not Komodo. No, it's not. <laughs> that was stupid confident, know. bro. <laughs> yeah, that shit was not what it is. I don't is. know what it's called in English. I'm just gonna say it's a dress shirt. No, dude, it's not it's a dress not. shirt. It's just a fucking yeah. button up, bro. What are you talking about? Yeah. It's a goddamn. Uh, let me think about it. I Fuck, I wish we had shirt. HR I got a in the dress building. Shirt. If I don't tuck it in and look kind of like that, it would just be long. I want to say dress shirt because when we say it in bed, it's like Al Yai, and Al Yai is like. In Al Yai? Yeah, it's like sweatshirt, sweater. Al Yai? Yeah. <laughs> yeah? That's pretty good. <laughs> it wasn't pretty good? It was. Come on, bro. Maybe. My native tongue. Maybe All you're right. the voice. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully you guys are doing good. Um, we're going to have a very special episode today. Why? Because we're talking. You know what I mean? It's a podcast. You know what I mean? Just some boys talking. Yeah, some boys just relaxing, chilling, talking on a mic. Like It was dead quiet. I don't know why I felt dead quiet. All right, bro. <laughs> it's the camera's on me for this part. <laughs> you, can't, you can't even smile. <laughs> Well, yeah, I upper deck it, bro. I'm an upper decker. Yeah. <laughs> you look like that goddamn, you're a mean one. <laughs> Ever tell you this one time when his family, when I was living with him, his family took me out to Seaside and we're at the pier. He's like, right, I'll give you like 10 bucks if you jump off the pier. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> it was, like, it was like just Convincing. like the sand. <laughs> I was like, oh, man, I think I can make that jump. And I fucking jump, come back up. Tim, he's like, I am not giving you that. <laughs> what the oh, fuck, wow. bro? You just that let him scandalous. not give you it? I'm so sorry, I, bro. Yeah, I didn't know what to do. Like, <laughs> I didn't know what to do. You about to whoop his ass, bro. <laughs> you, yeah. you jumped into water? No, it wasn't water. It was sand. It you was... jumped off a pier into sand. Yeah, it was just a sand. <laughs> He's not giving you ten bucks if you jump off of that. Yeah. That's not that's not me convincing, bro. I'm a liar. Bro. <laughs> yeah, bro. I'm a shitty no, person. I think, yeah. I, think I only say convince you because I'm pretty sure I said no the first few times, but you're like, bro, come on, just do it. <laughs> come, come on, on. Just, bucks, just do it. Come on. I did like, I show you the ten bucks or did I just say it? I think you just said. I probably didn't have ten bucks. Before, <laughs> I probably didn't. Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. I'm a fucking shitty ass person. <laughs> yeah. What, what, what conniving. Was your POS. Yeah. Conniving. That's what you are. Conniving. I like that. Yeah. Conniving. Yeah, he's the type yeah. to poison water supply. <laughs> Make a little girl eat rice once a year. You know what? For her birthday. <laughs> Not yeah, even it's a one piece reference. I'm talking about to get to the hot topics. Yeah. You're buzzing. The six. I'm not fucking talking about that. <laughs> well, Drake. <sighs> big news recently. Drake. Oh, Jersey news, Drake. <laughs> I'm going to mute myself for this whole shit, bro. Is this what we come to, bro? It's news, bro. This is gossip <laughs> girls, bro. This is this is gossip. We, you girl. talked about speeds, dick leak. Who fuck? Is, I didn't talk about no goddamn speed. Yes, dick you, leak. we did. Yeah, uh, bro. Yes, we did. That's like this person got exposed, right? And he actually had like something in jeopardy. Like, hey, I'm a twist streamer. This happened by accident. There's like a story behind it, bro. Yeah, you're talking about man's dick, bro. Like, what's like what else? Yeah, is I'm there, I'm, bro? I'm getting into it, bro. All right, bro. It's big. <laughs> oh, are you right? Well, in the comments, leave if you ever had a half chub. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> you want to let us know. How do you feel, bro? You've had your information leak before. I've had. Yeah. So how did that make you feel? It's 
exposed. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Mostly awkward, mostly knowing it got sent to you guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because if it got sent to like other women, you'd be like, oh shit, well, it free advertisement. Get, it got, it did get sent to like one of my old female friends that I probably haven't talked to since then. Oh, so the conversion mm. didn't go through? Yeah, so I think it was sent to her and then sent to you guys. And then she tried to post it on Facebook, but Facebook was. Facebook is crazy, but you got family and shit on Facebook, <laughs> don't you? Oh, and Facebook yeah. blocked it. Yeah. 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 Oh, good, good. Thank God, Berg. Yeah. We just shared it. <laughs> <laughs> would you be mad if we shared it? Yeah, you probably was would. Was that a marketplace? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's crazy. Good time, right, guy? Yeah. I mean, would you ever sell your dick? No. Yeah, I have, so I mean, y'all are already. Yeah, yeah, ass yeah, you I, 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 yeah, already, bro. Yeah, yeah. For how much? I think I already talked about this. Uh, cool, one fifty. I think you up in the price. No, oh, sorry. What's well, sorry? One hundred. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. One hundred dollars, <laughs> and then two fifty dollar gift cards. Mm. I can't remember. <laughs> I know one of them was Red Lobster, <laughs> and one I can't remember what the other one was. I don't got the rest, but I got these gift cards. I got yeah, Christmas. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Dude, I, I wanted my job, yeah. actually. <laughs> Can I be? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. That's good enough. Come on. <laughs> ah, <laughs> cheap up. I guess, yeah. That's a word. It's a cheap up. Yeah, yeah. For sure, bro. <laughs> I didn't think, bro. I, I mean, I don't know about y'all. I, I've, he sold I've never... his body for gift cards. <laughs> 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 the Red Lobster. <laughs> Hey, you know what I mean, bro? What's it, next, coupon? It happens to everybody. Hey, that'd 30% be crazy. off? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I don't know, bro. I made money. Towels are expensive. I made money. You know what I mean? Yeah. I would. I didn't do it again. Yeah. Because in my head, I was like, I'm finna grind for this goddamn. It was a woman. Pause. Well, like, pause yeah. for the grind part. Uh, it was a woman. Uh, it. <laughs> I need to hold it. And I was gonna uh, work through it right so I can get my PS5 and shit. Mm. Cause back then you couldn't get them in stores. You had to know somebody, so you had to pay a premium, right? So I'm over here. I said, shit, well, I might as well just sell some dick, you know, <laughs> see how far I get. And to be honest, bro, I was really just kind of fucking around. Like, I just threw that message out there, and they were like, yeah, okay, how cool. You... When and where? Oh, yeah, what was the message? Yeah, I wanna, yeah how did you throw it out there? Oh, yeah. shit. Because I didn't know it was text. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What no, you I, 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 had said, I had said, oh, like, I had said some shit like, uh, something about being an escort before, bro. Like, just like. Oh yeah, like it's regular. I've I've done this before, right? And then they ask, like, how much did you charge, right? Mm. And I didn't know how much to really value myself, you know what I mean? So I just said, well, I mean, it's nothing wrong with a Benji, you know what I mean? A hundred dollars. Sold them so short. Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah. So the the gift cards was actually like, oh here mm, you go, the yeah, tip. yeah, it was yeah. a tip. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for, yeah, that shit was. Customary. Get yourself something to eat. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Smack the one <laughs> Hey, ain't nobody smoking. That'd be crazy, bro. Yeah, Here yeah. Here you go, sweetheart. That shit, yeah. I would say if I, yeah, that whole shit, I didn't. Yeah. I, I had to, yeah. I had to. I drank a lot that day. Bro. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, like before the. Before, we, during, after, bro. I, were yeah. you able, like, did you perform for your honey? Bro, he was I mean, facing nah, some bro. demons that day. Like, bro, <laughs> bro, yeah. I was. Like, was did she get her money's worth? Hell no, nah, bro. She nah. Yeah, hell no, nah, bro. Was it on her face? I don't fucking know, bro. Like I'm saying, to her, was it worth it? Oh, I mean, like, do you feel like she got personally? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. No, she was trying to schedule a follow up, bro. And then I, <laughs> I quit. Like <laughs> I quit as soon as that bottle left my system. I was like, I'm never doing that shit oh, again. Oh shit! Yeah, that shit was short lived. Yeah, it put you out of business. Bro. Yeah, yeah. It is hard I, on the soul, I put, bro. Yeah, I put myself. Well, I mean, yeah, that that interaction was the worst one. Probably the worst. Imagine one. your son knowing that you're gonna get it. Yeah, I'll, like tell I'll tell him. I'll tell him. You know what I mean? It's it's a it's a learning curve. Yeah. You know what I mean? At what age though? Do you start dropping bombs like that? Twenty? Um, nah, 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 probably sooner than that. I think like it will probably have more in conversation piece. You know what I mean? Like just kind of kind of say it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I remember when I sold my first dick. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I said, don't think. Yeah, don't be above nothing, cause your old man. You know. <laughs> Red Lobster right there. That's where I cashed it at right there, you know? But uh It's college money. Yeah. I say actuality is just kinda like I'm not one to like hide my experience. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? Like if we're talking about it, we're talking about it. You know, mm -hmm. I I'll laugh about it, I'll learn, hey, that's some dumb shit to be doing. Yeah. So but, you'll be open with like your drug use and like I'm, sexual experiences. Yeah. I'm talking oh, about yeah, like yeah, when yeah. you started smoking weed, <laughs> you got and, like, hair on, when you started having sex and like 
Yeah, I yeah, for sure. Said drug yeah, yeah. Juice. I was like, yeah. what? Juice. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I so you thinking like sixteen? Um, I think when it's appropriate, bro. Like yeah. some, like some, some people just don't get to that point yet. Yeah. Like Junior Sixteen's never watched porn, bro. Like he's like, no, I'm telling you, like, bro, you could tell when some people know shit, bro. At twelve, bro, I knew shit. You know what I mean? Well, I was like, oh, bro, I was playing time. dumb as fuck, bro. No, dude, I'm saying like, I, I was a full blown. Yeah, bro. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm saying conniving, like, bro. actually, bro. Like, like, this what shit gave you that idea? But just like, there's like a certain look, bro. Like, I just feel like you kind of know. You just know if someone watches. Yeah, like you can see it in the <laughs> eyes, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. You can see that like, somebody knows it, and he's just like completely oblivious to it, bro. Like, yeah. Bro, you can't be oblivious to titties, bro. I'm sorry. Or whatever bro, he's into. He, he's like nervous about kisses still, bro. Like that shit is kind of. I've been. I was saying the same things though, bro. All right, bro. It's not you. Yeah, right? no, bro. Like it's I'm saying, like you, kids bro. lie, bro. Like people lie, and like they will. Okay. Like if it's embarrassing, well, porn right, yeah, is embarrassing yeah. as fuck. Yeah. Like nobody wants to be like, yeah, yeah I'm in there yeah. jacking off. Like yeah, no, nah, bro. That's funny. That shit's that's like think about. <laughs> you want to keep that shit inside? Bro, you gotta watch this. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. I would say, yeah, whenever he's, like, mature enough to hear it, you know, I'm not yeah. obviously going to just tell him shit like that. Hey, bro, before you go to second grade, son, let me tell you something. Never do this. Yeah. Bro. I was out here some dick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, nah, I'm pretty open about my experiences, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's pretty cool. I, I think that y'all have some interesting experiences that kind of help me feel like I know you guys better. So if you guys just started shutting off, like, stories and shit or hiding details, which is, ah, you know what I mean? Oh, like, yeah. I think it's funny to crack up about shit like that. You yeah, know? yeah, yeah. Like Ryan's story, that shit was mad awkward <laughs> I when was it came out. Who he was finna... <laughs> it was mad awkward His when that shit coming dropped. Up. You know what I mean? But after hearing about it, it was funny. Which story yeah. are you talking about? All of them, bro. The fucking the, the <laughs> dick leak, the bro playing the scorpion. Stop, I didn't say that. <laughs> you stealing another, another nigga's dad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. God damn it, bro. Man, it's spent night at your book, yeah. That's who, yeah that's the car funny. accident. Cars and it's pretty, yeah, yeah, that's pretty funny. All Pinocchio the details is there. crazy. Pinocchio, yeah, that's good. You got some highlights, bro. You got some uh, throwing up, throwing, throwing up, up everywhere. in the club. <laughs> yeah, everywhere. That's pretty. And then he bro, he went back to that with his cousins or no, your sister, right? You was hanging out with them, and then you threw. Anyway, it was a different club. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you was... at a different club, <laughs> <laughs> bro. You're known, bro. <laughs> this guy is crazy, bro. Is. I think you hide in the closet like in your teenage years or being oh like, under a bed in a closet. Twice. Yeah, dude. I was about to say that shit. Was hilarious, <laughs> wasn't it like the closet one? It was like a girl ended up having like a family barbecue. And no, you're like, bro, Stop. I could I could describe it, bro. So it was pretty yeah. much I was young at the time. So so it was she. seventeen. Yeah. And 17? Yeah, 17. It was 16, 17. Yeah. And I went over to her house and she was not allowed to have anybody over. So I was going over there in the dead of night, bro. One time I went over there, I would like, it, this is the worst position to be in as a black young man. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. But, you caught yourself, right? Was she white? Huh? Was no, she, white? she was uh, Mex Latina. Okay. Yeah, oh, I have no one, idea, yeah, really, yeah, bro. I only seen her at night, bro. <laughs> like, there's some points I'm like, do I even really know what she looks like, bro? <laughs> If I didn't yeah. see her like semi recently, like outside, yeah. right? I think she works like in a club somewhere or something, like one of those bottle yeah. girls. Yeah. All right. Um, but I would sneak over there. But how yeah. I had to get into the house mm -hmm. was like through the side. So it was like a little. It was like kind of on a hill. I had to climb through it, go jump on the garbage to get over a wooden gate. And I'm seeing like the the neighbors like uh, motion lights flick on and shit. I'm seeing their blinds start opening it, and I'm trying to hide, but also not like be like, eh, but also trying yeah, to be yeah, like yeah. I'm not here. Yeah. Um. Eventually, I make it to the back, bro. I'm I'm good. Bro. It's kind of in my blood. <laughs> back door and it's kind of. Yeah. Um, but I made it to the back. I go, like I have to like go into like the basement part. Uh, one part I had, like her dad almost intervened while I was trying to go down there. I had to walk through the kitchen part, bro. Mm. That part was scary as hell. Yeah, because I'm like just seeing how these niggas live, and if I bro, picturing this as a man, and if I have a daughter, and that the fact that some nigga could just be creeping around my house, yeah, and I'm just like, Doo -doo 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 -doo. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, Ooh, bro, that's hiding it. behind the lamp. Like it's not. <laughs> it's it's that's spooky, bro. It's spooky yeah, to think of. Yeah, yeah. But 
Especially if I had bad intentions too. Oh like, yeah. Like you know, like if I didn't like she didn't I mean, know me, bro. Those are bad intentions. <laughs> 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 Fucking dropping off Christmas ornaments and shit, bro. You was out there trying to do the deed, bro. Yeah. I was yeah. Doing if you was you, dirty. yeah. Yeah. Um But so uh eventually I make it down to the basement, mm-hmm. bro. Um I have a long foreplay <laughs> depending if I can get hard or not. So mm. if I'm extra cuddly, I'm just I ain't getting. I'm not getting there. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And so sometimes I get nervous. So like, and like yeah, now yeah, I'm like yeah. trying to get this shit up. I'm like working. I'm like first yeah, time yeah, meeting yeah. too. Um, uh, nah, but I think this is probably like our second, my second, third oh, time yeah, going over still, there. Still hella new. Yeah, but going it's, over there. Yeah, cause I would yeah. always have to go over there. Yeah, yeah, I'm talking about. But you got creeped around before, like yes. Motherfucker had the layout, bro. <laughs> yes, bro. Goddamn. The blueprints. Yeah. <laughs> he goes to bed at this time. Yeah, okay. Go ahead. Yeah. Third bro, time sure, over. Bro. Okay, okay. And it'll be spooky. Like, sometimes she would stop responding mm. while I'm like back there and shit. And she's like, oh, I was talking to my dad real quick. And one time I was back there for like 20 minutes, bro. And I thought she just like ghosted me. And I was just like, this bitch, bro. I'm going <laughs> to knock on the door and shit. And then she had like called me real quick. And I was like, oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you. Yeah. yeah. You leave it out. I was here to fuck your dog. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, but I make it to the base and we form my hand it up, whatever. And then I just hear, doom, doom, doom. And it's mm. wooden steps going down to a basement. Yeah, bro. It's yeah, loud yeah. as shit. And she's just like, oh, 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 and I'm just like, ah, and then, <laughs> and then yeah. she's just like, ah, oh, my dad is coming. Oh shit, bro! I'm like, think quick, think quick. She, her, bro, her bed was so shallow to the ground, bro, mm. because it was open as fuck underneath it. But it was like one of those beds that have those drawers and shit at the end. Oh, yeah. So I had to kind of like push it up and under my so I was pretty much scraping my whole back off. <laughs> oh, like my whole back was peeled off, bro. Yeah. And I just like in, under there and then like popped it over and then he popped in through the door. Like exact timing? Like bro, as soon as you got bro, it. Indiana Jones under oh. the <laughs> grab the hat at the end, bro. It was like an yeah, inch of it. That's pretty crazy. Yeah, yeah. And so I'm under there, bro. <laughs> and at this point. I'm out of breath, bro. Yeah. Like, it's hard as fuck to push my body through. Yeah. So I'm, <sighs> and I hear him start engine closer. And I'm like, I gotta hold my breath, bro. <laughs> I had to hey, hold my breath, uh, bro. Imagine if you hold your breath, bro, and you fucking farted. <laughs> <laughs> hey, they gotta act like a fucking mouse did it. That'd be crazy. All right, go ahead. She's like, oh, you stink. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry to me cut you off. Go ahead, bro. But ahead. so I'm under there, bro. As soon as he gets next yeah. to the bed, I'm like, I'm holding my breath. Mm-hmm. I thought you would just kind of check in and peek real quick. Mm-hmm. He gets in and starts to get us it. get it, get it, get it. Yeah, whatever the fuck in Spanish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Long ass conversation, but he's on the other side. I see blue Air Forces mm-hmm. with white soles, bro. Oh, okay. That's a Yankees fan or an old Cholo, bro? <laughs> he <laughs> was. The other. I got the deets on what he was after. But okay, yeah. he, um, not good shoes, bro. Not, they weren't dress <laughs> no, shoes, no, bro. No, no, no. Like, no, no. And he's inside the house <laughs> just walking around the Air Forces. Oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> at like two in the morning. Like, uh, it's like it's hella crazy. late. Um, so he came down expecting something pretty much. Because it's like you probably would either came down barefoot or with slippers. But you put your shoes on, and I'm like, because yeah, you heard yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. You didn't just pop down here in yeah. the middle of the night to go check on your daughter for nothing, you know? So he's like, kind of like, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's talking to her, but he's kind of just like, look, like, I can see his feet just kind of like wandering mm. around. And as he's coming around the bed, bro, my head is just steaming right now. I can feel like my like veins starting to pop up. My eye is like <laughs> starting to ooze out, bro. Wait, my wait, lungs. Are you in your draws? Like, what are you? What are you? I'm fully clothed still, bro. Oh. I wasn't hard yet, oh, bro. Yeah, yeah, I'm not yeah, taking yeah, nothing yeah. out oh, until I at least get half right, chubbed, cool, cool, bro. Cool. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Wasn't even chubbed in there. It was a basement. It was cold. But so I was under there, and I start seeing him walk around, mm-hmm. and then all right, this one I'm like because my fucking brain is about to explode bro and i look over to the side he's about to get on 
and my fucking neon pink backpack is sitting off on the side of the bed. And then as I see him go, like, walking through, he's like, oh, and just, like, shakes it real quick. And I'm assuming in Spanish, she's asking, like, what is that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she was like, oh, oh, that's just like my, I was like, she switched to English, like my friends, whoever girl name. And he was like, mm, no, yeah. Neon Pink saved you. Yeah, Yeah. bro. But when I saw his feet (laughs) go over and him reach down, bro. Bro, the the (laughs) lights, bro. (laughs) The lights, bro. I let out the breath. The nigga just sat down on the bed. Ooh. And then continued fucking talking. I don't the I'm glad because of the oomph let out for me to get that mm. back in, but trying to breathe quietly. Yeah. Is yeah. the most well, is the loudest thing ever, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you ever tried to hide and yeah, breathe yeah, yeah. at the same time. Yeah, it's, it's impossible. Adrenaline bro. pumping too. That shit is ridiculous, bro. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Uh, bro, bro, it's scary as hell. What would have happened if he did lift up the mat? Like, what? Do you have? Did you think about that while you were underneath? Like, if he's gonna lift this shit up, he's gonna lift this shit up. What was gonna be your reaction to that, bro? Because I mean, he's wearing Air Forces inside the house, bro. We have to also understand this is a criminal at this point. <laughs> um, at the time, what I was thinking was was folding. Immediately crying, probably. <laughs> yeah, but I was lightheaded. Yeah, yeah, I was, yeah, yeah. I was scared. It was nighttime. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That shit is emotional. My man. bus doesn't even come at this time yet. <laughs> if I have to leave right now, bro, I'm gonna be out here for like forty minutes. <laughs> <laughs> like, so I was like, I would try to push off of him and run up and out. Mm. Especially, cause I know what his kitchen looked like. I probably <laughs> jump over the island, <laughs> just hurdle that shit real quick. <laughs> yeah, that shit would be pretty athletic. I'm stupid as fuck, dude. Oh yeah. Yeah, bro, I should have went home immediately after that shit. Good point. Like, Good I point. almost got arrested or beat the fuck up or shot. Mm. Like, when I told my dad, he's like, you could just got shot. For that. Like, that's true. Easy as hell. Like, yeah, breaking yeah. into somebody's back of the house. Like, yeah, you hell get yeah. fucking shot. Yeah, hell yeah, yeah, yeah. To fuck, explore. I'm just here to fuck you down. Like, nah, bro. You get a, <laughs> you get a fucking shot, bro. Let me get the half choke before you kill me. I don't want nobody to know. <laughs> yeah, I don't want the ambulance to. <laughs> yeah, this guy didn't even make it through. <laughs> Poor little guy. <laughs> he doesn't have a chance at life. <laughs> just my oh, ghost. Fuck, is just, yeah. you, didn't, you didn't tug it. You didn't. <laughs> Oh yeah, fuck yeah! But I mean that that made for a hell of a conversion rate. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. That was because you went home after that, right? Obviously. Yeah. You know, you probably stayed a little what ten minutes after. No. Wow. Okay. All right. Good. So, how did you feel going home? Did you feel accomplished? Did you feel like you regretted it? Because I was just like, woo! It was just like, no, I was happy about it. At yeah. The time yeah. Because I was like, oh, I'm slick as fuck. Yeah. Bro. Yeah. Like, because I've always had this thing about me where I'm like, things just kind of work out. Yeah. yeah, like it just it just goes weirdly good sometimes. Yeah, Obviously, yeah. I get fucked in some situations, but <laughs> I don't use that all the time because I get angry about getting fucked. Yeah, yeah but yeah, when yeah. The things do go good, I'm like, oh, I just got a weird, crazy look. Yeah, and I was riding that high all the way home. That's good. That's um, totally good. Yeah, but afterwards, it was definitely like that is some stupid ass shit to do. Yeah, because uh, it's just way too many things that could go wrong. Oh yeah, hell and then for something that's not that big of a deal, mm-hmm. like we weren't. Interest like we were just horny, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. It was weird, it's teenage, young shit. you know. Yeah, 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 it was weird, young shit to do. Yeah, yeah. she was being stupid and shit. She could have got me fucked up. She was gonna be fine at the end of the yeah, day. You know what I'm saying? Sure, She's sure. not gonna get shot. She ain't getting arrested. She might get kicked out by her dad. You know? Yeah. I don't know how uh, Latino or Hispanic parents feel about shit like that. Yeah, probably she got kicked out. Yeah, yeah. I had to go stay somewhere else for a little bit. Yeah, that she had a sense. twin sister too. Oh, twin? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah. Her sister was like right next door. And she would text her sometimes about the shit. Ooh. Yeah. That's, you're crazy as hell, bro. Yeah. All she got to do is be fed up with it. <laughs> and that's your ass, bro. It's grass. <laughs> it's grass. Coming. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the guy's here. Yeah. yeah. And then the closet was different, bro. <laughs> the closet was way more uncomfortable. I had like a... I think I told you about my cellar experience. You're in a cellar? Yeah, yeah, wine cellar. 
Yeah. No, I've never heard of this. All right, go ahead, settle down, folks. Settle down. <laughs> can we show Ryan settle down, please? <laughs> HR, can we show Ryan settle down, please? Go ahead, calm down, Ryan. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and relax, Ryan. <laughs> it's just a story at the end of the day. Just make sure you listen. Um, <clears throat> I was 16, right? I don't think I was bad as hell, but I would never let my son do this. Um, verbally, right? Me and my shorty at the time. Mm. <clears throat> fuck her. Mm. Anyways, uh, we're, we're going through a breakup, right? She's saying all this shit. Woo woo. You know, this is what me and my ass used to do. This is what you're not doing. This is this is that, right? It was it was bad, right? And I was like, well, this is what I'm doing. This is what you This was doing. your girlfriend at the time saying that. At the that. time, bro. Saying this is what my time. ex used to do. This is what this is how I got this side of me. This is why you bring out that side of me type shit. You know what I mean? Mm. Just she was a manipulator. She was a narcissist, yeah. right? At the end of the day. But anyways. So and I and at that time, oh yeah, at that time, right? It's my second girlfriend. I'm naive to this whole play shit, you know. This whole back then they didn't call it gaslighting. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's called <laughs> you it smart kids. Yeah, yeah. I was being manipulated. It's <laughs> yeah. way different. Um. Anyway, so we're going through a breakup, right? On the phone, right? And it's like <laughs> twelve o'clock, right? Oh, it's and so I'm, yeah, I'm being, you know, my mom's trying to go to bed. My little brother's sleeping next to me. You know, we used to share a bed, right? My little brother. I'm going through this with my with my girl, and I'm like, fuck it. I'm not about to talk to you on the phone. This is difficult as hell. You know, I'm not finna text you. I'm not finna talk. Like, I'm gonna go see you. Mm. And she was like, you're not gonna see nobody because it's late. Like, my parents sleeping. You cannot come over. I was so like upset. I was like, I'm taking the next bus to go see you. You're going to bus. I'm going to be there in, I guess, whenever the bus shows up. Cause back then, yeah, yeah. You didn't really know how long you were going to take. Back I'll be then. there in 546. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I took the last bus, because I had to take two buses mm-hmm. to get to her house, right? I took the last bus, 72, to get to Powell. Mm. I took. The Powell nine bus nine, to yeah. get to uh, by her house, right? Mm-hmm. Last one running for both of those of the night, right? So at this point, I'm not even thinking how to get back. I'm going to go talk to the shorty Drunk about whatever the love, fuck, bro. right? <laughs> <laughs> and I'm 16 at the time, right? I don't know where the fuck my mom thought I was going. I don't even know my mom knew I went out, but I went out, right? That is crazy. You used to have that. Yeah, I just left, right? And I go... Uh, she had a basement, right? Because she has a house, right? So middle, top story, basement. But you can walk downstairs. Man. It's like it's like a living room basement. Yeah. Yeah. God. If I have a like, yeah, if I have yeah. a daughter, I'm never getting a house. No in basement. basement. Yeah. Put a lock on that bitch. <laughs> no lock doors. <laughs> <laughs> and she used to have this like uh, this window next to it, right? Mm. But that's not like that window was always shut. So my immediate thing was I'm just gonna go through the window, right? I didn't know it was like a never open window, right? She says you can't go through the window. You got to go through the back. Right, I'm gonna open the dog door, and then you gonna crawl through. I said I'm not gonna fucking go through no goddamn dog door. Yeah. Just open the door for me, and I'm gonna run where the fuck I don't need to run to. Don't even got no big dogs. Exactly. She had like that like medium oh, dog. Oh yeah, she had that yeah, medium yeah. Lola. Dog. Sorry. Yeah, Lola. Yeah, <laughs> damn. You said I didn't even. Yeah, yeah. You got all details. I forgot she was big. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> that dog named Lola. So she told her parents I'm gonna go take uh, Lola for a walk, right? Which is weird for a 16 year old to do at. 12 o'clock at fucking night and it's fucking yeah anyway so she yeah so she goes takes the love for a walk right brings her back when she comes back in with the dog i run in there right i hear lola's feet shuffle like as if she heard something right and i'm like fuck she's gonna bark because it's me right nothing that dog was cool as hell bro must have recognized my scent but that motherfucker was so I go downstairs, right? Smelled another dog in there, bro. And then they said they go into bed. I hear them all this shit. <laughs> Must have known about me. They go to bed and shit, right? And so we downstairs talking, right? I think she has to say, yeah, like, you know, they're old. They, they're going to go to sleep. They're knocked out for the whole night, mm. right? And I was like, good, because we're going to work this shit out. Because this is stupid. <laughs> like, you know way, I came over here. This is what it is. This is what it should look like. All this stuff, you know, trying to be a hero. You know what I mean? Mm. And me, dun, her, dun, dun. me and her are going through it. And I think we're getting to a point where we're starting to realize that this shit might not work out, right? Because we just keep butting heads. Mm. And then I hear a light flicker upstairs, right? Because the basement is two sets of stairs, right? One that goes upstairs, one that goes down to the basement, mm. right? But there's no door to the basement. So you can hear upstairs and it's wood floors, right? 
And you can even hear the top floor if if you're quiet enough, right? Mm-hmm. And me and her are whispering at this point because we don't wake nobody yeah. up. Her fucking parents just start their morning routine <laughs> at fucking 2, 3 a.m. <laughs> 2, 3 a.m., bro. And I forget because when you're old. Are you? <laughs> oh, you probably yeah. left at like 12. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got there. Yeah, we got there like at 2 or some shit like that, yeah. right? They were already supposed to be in bed or some shit, you know? Something around those times. <laughs> like, I, I, yeah, I was young. I didn't check my yeah. phone, but the parents, I went to bed. I snuck in through the back, um, me and her talking, and then we just hear them turn on the lights, right? And we're like, what the fuck? And then we start hearing them walk around and shit, you know? I have a, I have a question yeah, beforehand. That. What was y'all's issue? So she had still been best friends with her uh, ex, right? Like mm. close friends, right? I had asked a girl that she hated who used to be my good friend for relationship advice to save our our relationship, right? Because mm. I couldn't get over her being cool with him and I couldn't mm. be cool with her. But I, I talked to her, I said So she was friends with her ex. Yeah, I was like, why should this be cool and not not like not this way, right? Mm. My friend gave me some good advice. It said you accept people what they is, you see what you're coming with. If it's not cool with you, then you move on, right? And yeah, over here, was. yeah, and for, over here I was like, okay, cool. All I gotta do is just not give a shit about it and it's gonna resolve itself, right? When I had texted, because I had a new attitude, right? Because yeah. I was arguing with her at first, talked to Shorty, talked back to my Shorty. Yeah. I was like, oh, cool. I got it like resolved. I'm cool. They said, what the fuck did you do? I was, And then I, again, I had a lot of integrity back then. So I just said it. <laughs> oh, I asked this person for advice. They told me this. And this is the shit that now makes us good. And then it was like, well, no, because my ex used to fuck with her and... He used to do this to me and hide behind my back, and now you hiding behind my back some shit. And I was like, that's not me. I'm telling you what it is up front. She didn't believe me through text, through calls. So I went to go in person to prove mm. to her that I'm all like, look, I'm straightforward. Like, I'm not giving yeah. fuck around. Stupid as shit. Stupid as shit, yeah. bro. For that person, the dumbest <laughs> shit ever. Anyways, fuck them. Did it feel that passionate at the time? Hell yeah, dude. Yeah. To be like in a base, I don't know. I don't care what, like, being in a basement, like, you know the feeling. Yeah. <laughs> like, afraid for the truth to come out, you know what I mean? To get discovered and stuff. Like, it, it's an intimate moment, you know what yeah. I mean? It's like, the drill's pumping, you just trying to, I don't know, you trying to keep that energy going type yeah. shit. They wake up. They start going down the stairs. They start making themselves fucking coffee. Shit like that. <laughs> Lola's running around and shit. And I think that, because Lola used to get sedated. Right, because she was a crazy ass dog. She used to run everywhere. Oh, she wow. wasn't crazy. She was just a dog. Yeah, but. and they're old. Yeah, like... they said, yeah. And so I didn't realize this, but when she had taken Lola for a walk, Lola was sedated. So that's why she wasn't mm. like barking and doing crazy shit like high. that. Yeah, exactly. And so I'm over here like after hearing that, she was like, "Oh well, she, her medication's probably rubbing off." I said, "Well, go inject her again." You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. still down here. She's like, "Wait, wait, wait, wait. We gotta hide you." Right, and I was like, "What the fuck does that mean?" So we got my parents cannot fucking see you here because they knew me, right? I don't think they like me too much. I'm gonna be honest with mm-hmm. you. The dad, yeah, the dad was always cool. She was adopted. Mm-hmm. The the dad was always cool. The mom was like, "No man is good enough for my daughter." Type shit, and you mm-hmm. got to be working at fucking fifteen, sixteen, uh, fucking I don't corporate. Know my wife, man. Yeah, yeah, because you weren't dating her. You know Thanks. what I mean? Like, so me, I was Thanks. dating her. So she just had a piece of shit person. She doesn't want like another piece of shit yeah, person. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um. Anyway, so yeah, my shorty was like, "All right, you gotta go hide." And I was like, "What the fuck am I gonna hide?" She was like, "Follow me, right?" I followed her. I at the time, bro, I had no idea what the fuck a wine teller looked like, or what the fuck it was. This happened after I googled the shit, <laughs> post everything happening. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. So all I get to like really experience for the first time is she said, "Go in here." She Push, pushes me in. <laughs> Closes the fucking door. <laughs> Closes the door, bro. And in that cellar, I don't know for what reason, bro, but like you can't open it once you're inside. You can only open it from the outside, bro. And so I'm in this bitch, bro. It's cold. I'm surrounded by wine bottles that I don't give a shit about. Now I probably, you know, probably would drink something, you know, it's to kind of relieve. Yeah. <laughs> Italy, huh? Really experienced places. 1817. Yeah, yeah, dude. But it's it's meant to be like a cool area for the wine to be yeah. all cool. And I'm over there like, I left my shit out there. You know what I mean? So I could hear her shuffling because 
wine cellar basement, right? So we next door. Yeah. I get here shuffling, trying to put my shit away, right? Mm, she was smart enough. Yeah, ex <laughs> exactly. In case they came down, neon blue. <laughs> <laughs> um. And so I'm over there, like. Bro, I shit you like if your shit felt like thirty minutes, my shit was literally thirty minutes, bro. <laughs> yeah. I was walking in that wine cellar, bro, just thinking like, I got out of my mom's house, <laughs> took the last bus here, last bus there, to argue with this girl. <laughs> and bro, I don't know that type of self reflecting at at fucking three a.m. in the wine cellar, bro. Yeah. The first fifteen minutes was like I deserve better. The last 15 minutes was like, nah, I'm fucking angry. I'm about to start banging on these goddamn bottles and shit. Because what the fuck am I doing here, right? Help. Yeah. I hear the door open, right? I immediately, bro, just fucking disguise myself as a bottle. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, nah. There's like two parts of the room. So there's the wine cellar. Well, it's still wine cellar. And then there's like this little door. Not door, like a, what do you call it? shit? Like a doorway? Yeah, a doorway. A little corridor. Yeah, exactly. So it's two parts. Here's oh, actually I parts walk y'all through. So here's the face of it. You open the door. Here's the wine bottle and stuff like that. There's a room back here, like a little storage closet, if you will. And there's no door here either. It's just the one. So when I heard the door open, I, I immediately jumped to the storage closet. Nothing else. If they would have just walked into the storage closet, I would have been fucked. Like there's nowhere else you can go. You yeah. know what I mean? Because the windows don't open. Yeah. And all I hear is, come on. I was like, what? I, I peeked my head like a little kid. <laughs> Trying to get, who said that? You know what yeah. I mean? If it wasn't her, I would have been fucked. Yeah. Yeah. I, got your ass. <laughs> yeah. Come on, gang. Um, Come on, right? And I immediately forgot that I was fucking pissed. I forgot that anything I was going through by myself in there, as soon as she said, come on, I, I ran, bro. I said, what now? She said, you got to leave. <laughs> And said, how the fuck I do that? She said, through the back door, the same way you came in, right? Because her back door leads to her uh, backyard, right? Yeah, how the fuck would you? That's what yeah. I'm saying, bro. I'm, I got to figure this out. <laughs> I have been there enough times to know the layout. So um, the first floor is kind of up a little bit. So if you open the back door to like their backyard, there's like these stairs you got to go down. And then it's like concrete, then grass over here. And then there's a fence right here, like a wooden fence, probably about mm -hmm. six and a half feet tall, right? Maybe seven, right? This wooden fence. And that leads to like the street. And if you go straight, you get to the bus stop, right? But you got to go straight for like a block or two to get to the bus stop, right? That's how I came in. I initially came in from this street to get in there. So I recognized the back door, except when I got in the first time around, she had her dog and stuff. So I could just walk through, right? The second time around, I needed to walk stupid fast or run <laughs> through the back door and then find a way, like, let me tell you some shit, right? You tell somebody they need to leave, right? If they ask you how, you shouldn't just give them one goddamn step because they need to fucking escape. You know what I mean? Like, out the back door. Is out not... the back door, bro. I didn't think about it, but I grabbed my shit, bro, put my coat on, and she said, okay, I'm going to lead my people this way, and you got to just run through here. And I said, fuck it, leave the door open, creak, bro. <laughs> In hindsight, I think I fucking probably punched the door out the way to create more space for myself. I did not play that shit smooth. Yeah. <laughs> I'm free. Nah, dude, but I don't think, like, bro, I was so close to fucking up, dude, because I had to run, like, past stairs and shit, or mm -hmm. up the stairs, not trip, turn the corner, fucking get outside. Once I got outside, I was like, what the fuck do I do now? Because I had a, I fucking ran past all of them, bro. They yeah. probably saw me just... <laughs> the, and I, I used to have really big curly hair, bro. So you could draw me leaving, bro. That shit was just fucking... Anyway, I run out, right? I get to the middle of the backyard, bro, where it's just grass. Yeah, they still big. talking in there. They just heard somebody punch a window, I guess. <laughs> I don't know who the fuck did it. Um, And I'm all like, fuck, I'm not even out yet, right? I didn't think through. So I just looked at the at the wooden fence that they had just lying around, right? I couldn't open the gate. That would take too much time, make too much noise. I saw the gate. I was like, I think my Mexican blood kicked in. You know what I mean? Because I was like, I got to jump it. I got to just jump this with all I can. And Freedom on the other side, bro. Oh, God, dude. That's why I was like, <laughs> fuck it, dude. Like, I don't think I could have... I don't think I could like depict this moment 
other than it just being like like I close my eyes and just hope the miracle happened, bro. Cause I'm running, bro. Like <laughs> I don't even look at the fence, bro. I just feel it. Mm. And so I jump, got my hands on top, and push myself, bro. Like, and I'm I'm weak as hell at this point. There's no way in hell I should have God right there is real. I push myself over, bro. I thought in my head was a really clean jump. But when I got home, I had bruises on my knees and shit. So I probably fucking chip myself. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> Can you imagine you just hear doo doo doo? Ow, fuck. <laughs> See yourself punch through your back door. <laughs> and, and probably through the window. The through the window, you probably hear me fucking running this shit. You know what I mean? Because I had, yeah, I had some I thought it was boots fast on. as hell. They're watching you just struggle over the. <laughs> they had a ring ow, camera ow, the ow, whole time ow. just fucking showing. <laughs> Yeah, that shit was terrible. Yeah, but I I jumped through clean as I could have, mm. um, and tall when, gates. Yeah, yeah, tall gates, tall ass gates. And then I I get out of there. I'm all like, fuck, man, home free, right? Mm. How'd you get home? Until I realized I got to get home. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was like, home free. It's, it's huh. three thirty a.m. Right? <laughs> the bus don't come till like fucking six or seven a.m. I took the last bus. Both times to get to that shorty's crib, bro. We didn't even talk about the shit that happened. You know, she don't make sure I got over the fence right. She didn't say, hey, why'd you punch a hole through my goddamn door? Nothing. I don't hear shit from her, right? <clears throat> and back then, um, oh man, I don't remember having really good service to call somebody to pick me. I don't think nobody would even pick up even. But I don't remember having like service like that to be calling people, right? Um, and so I'm like, fuck. The bus is not going to come. I'm fucking... I don't even know how many blocks away I am, bro. I just have to yeah. face that I'm going to be walking. <laughs> like, I don't even know. Let me check, bro, actually. It's like 50 seconds. <clears throat> you live on like like 90, like 80 something. Yeah, bro. I'm, I'm it's like 40 some blocks. And that's not included sideways. <laughs> that shit is pretty crazy. That's just far as fuck. Let me see if I yeah. try... Yeah. If I try walking now, what? how long would it take? Cool. It took me an hour and five minutes to walk yeah. home from where I was at. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it took me an hour and five minutes. Oh, you to, made it. You made the walk. I had, what else am I going to do, bro? <laughs> yeah. You think I'm going to wait till 7 a.m.? Fucking four, no, I decided, I, I decided to walk, bro. And this was like the craziest, weirdest walk through like Foster. You know, you're 16. You got a backpack with, I don't know what the fuck I had in that backpack, bro. I just had a hoodie or some shit. And I'm just walking through as foggy as shit outside. I'm going through Foster. There's nobody, bro. There's nobody nowhere. And I'm just walking there like... <laughs> nowadays, I'd be paranoid as shit. I'd be like, fuck, dude. I got to be in a better situation. But back mm. then, I was just walking like, yep. This fucking walk sucks. <laughs> yeah. I could have been stabbed at any point in time, bro. It's not like... 3 a.m. Robbed. Fuck, yeah, dude. I get but home. Also, it's also but like young walking, I didn't mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah. back in the day, no, the hour like, went oh, by really. Shit, an hour and something the, yeah. the bus there, whatever, bro. <laughs> whatever. It's pretty quick, actually. Yeah. I get home at like fucking five a.m. Dude, it was like super late because I had to procrastinate if I was gonna walk or not. You know what I mean? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. I get home at like five a.m. and <laughs> I lay down in my bed. My little brother's knocked the fuck out. Nobody, bro. Nobody was up waiting for me. <laughs> Nobody had sent me a text. Hey, where you at? I just lay down in my bed, go to sleep, and then I wake up to go to school the next morning, bro. <laughs> like nothing ever happened. And if a girl has you hiding in the basement, this it's not worth it. Uh, would you say it is? It's never. It's worth never it, worth bro. it. So make sure y'all actually take care of yourselves because that is ridiculous. It's a hell of experience, bro. And I will. I'd be remiss to say I didn't have fun during it, but I would never do it again. Yeah, I would, I would say that, but I did it again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got in somebody's closet like, right after that, dude. She was yeah. crazy. That, is... that time was <clears throat> fucked up, though. I kind of did her bad. Oh, yeah, yeah. But I was mad. <laughs> I was mad because... <laughs> Bro, like the... Yeah. Okay, so the text before, freaky as fuck. Like, mm. it was probably like... Like, she was... Like, oh, yeah, we down for this. We down for that. At school, freaky as fuck. Like, oh, yeah, we down for this. We down for that. I get there, and I got hit with a technicality that it was our first time technically hanging out. Ooh. So it's like, I can't. It's our first time hanging out. But technically, next time you come, I told you I don't want to wait. But, you know, 
This was after a good 80 minutes of making out, bro. <laughs> <laughs> this is like two hours yeah. of making out. And then Bluetooth she's already like, connected. <laughs> that is crazy. Bro, and then she, I get it, bro. I'm, at this point, I'm ready to present the chub, bro. This is. <laughs> I actually have a signature going on here. <laughs> That's pretty crazy. But, bro, so she hits me with this. So we're just, I'm just sitting there bro, watching TV at this chick's house, just like, mm. Thinking about all this shit, like we could have, would have, yeah, could have yeah, been. Yeah, yeah. And I was even more mad because it was a person that I was not even really interested in. Oh shit! So it was just like I, you convinced me through these words that yeah, come over yeah. here. And at the time, I'm not active like that. So getting something is lucky. Yeah. And shit, I'm like, all right, fine. Shoot down the pride, go over there, and I got hit with bougie shit. Yeah, yeah. Salty as hell sitting there watching some type of cartoon. Don't remember what it is, bro. To see dark lines. <laughs> um, seeing red. Yeah. And then yeah. I hear the keys, like just a bundle of keys hit the front door mm. and it's shaking hard as fuck. She starts freaking out. She's just like, fuck, fuck. She slammed her door closed. Because before, like, her little brothers and shit were walking by, she had a big younger brother. Uh, he was just tall and skinny and shit. And yeah. He kept just looking at me like, yeah, <laughs> obviously, yeah. It sucks being him, <laughs> but terrible guy. Um, so yeah, she slams the door shut and then she's like, "Get in the closet real quick." And I'm like, "Oh, okay, yeah, bet." It seems like a genius idea. Bro. I Is this first or second time? Second time. <laughs> I used to go into the bed. <laughs> <laughs> that's what my I was already on the floor, bro. And she was yeah, like, "No, nah, yeah. not nah, the closet." I was like, "Ah, genius, oh, okay. right?" That's, <laughs> that's wild. Yeah. That's so wild I'm wild. like, "Okay, cool." I open it, bro. This shit is filled with like, what are those little boxes that you pop the not Tupperware, but like I'll be thinking it's Tupperware. The, the giant Tupperware, like storage boxes. bins. And yeah, shit. shit ton of storage bins and shit ton of clothes hanging down. Mm. It's packed out. It's dirty as fuck in this closet. <laughs> There's no room in there, bro. Yeah. And I like, I'm looking, how the fuck am I supposed to get in here? And then she's just like, just, and she starts like stepping me in, kicks my feet sideways. Oh, wow. So I'm like, <laughs> this, bro. And then she just slides it like barely over <laughs> my face. And this is one of those like little wooden ones that slide yeah, with the little yeah, plastic yeah. clips on them, bro. So you could feel this thing. <laughs> As I'm against it, I could feel it like rattling a little bit against like the God damn. Her, I could I hear her come upstairs. He walks straight into her room. Mm. I guess this is because she, she wasn't suspicious of anything. This is I guess just a regular thing. She get off work, her mom. Yeah. Get off work, come into her room, and they just start chatting, talking about her day at work and shit. Talking about, like start gossiping about her coworkers and whatnot. What the hell? Asking about how school is. A bunch of bullshit yeah, bro and at yeah, this yeah. point i'm still angry about <laughs> about the text but now i'm also Shit. trying to balance myself sideways against this <laughs> fucking door yeah. trying not to touch it but there's no room backwards because it feels like if i lean back like it's gonna sound like dishes just, mm. brr, just falling <laughs> down and eventually bro this one was a little longer, bro. She was chatting like a motherfucker. And low-key, the bed was way more comfortable. Because at least I was flat just out and I couldn't breathe, though. Yeah, yeah. But having to hold myself... Because I didn't realize I was flexing pretty much trying to hold myself yeah. until the minutes started coming in. And then I started feeling it burn. And I had to kind of slowly just start touching up yeah, forward to yeah, it. Yeah. To the point kind of leaned, but it didn't like... <laughs> Rattle, yeah, bro. Yeah, but yeah. she's right on the other side of the door. Like, literally, like, yeah. where Ariel is, pretend there's a door in front of her. I'm just like, fuck no. Dude. Right yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. She Damn. leaves, bro. <laughs> she opened it and just saw my face, like, right yeah, there. Yeah, it's yeah. the most terrifying yeah, thing this ever. Is pretty scary. She go downstairs, bro, mm -hmm. and I don't know where she is at this time. And I come out, and we're just whispering, like, okay, like, what the, like, what the fuck are we supposed to do? <laughs> and then she's like, Wait here, like you just gotta wait here for a second, uh, and then I'm gonna like get her to go do da da da, da and her words are not penetrating my brain, bro. Mm. I'm thinking about all this ass I'm not getting right now, <laughs> and I, t I I just became petty immediately, dude. And like as she's talking, I'm just like, mm. 
and just walk downstairs. Wow. Yeah, I just open the door and like I see her brother like in the hallway or whatever the fuck, like the little one. And as I'm going down the steps, uh, I hear the TV and shit on. I hit the bottom because it's a wall. So yeah, until yeah. you hit the bottom of the steps and hit the corner where the front door is, because the yeah. front door goes straight at the steps. So you go down the steps and I hit the front door. I grab it and I look back just to see yeah. bro, what's behind me. And I just see a whole family <laughs> like looking. <laughs> just like, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> and I'm like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I have a thing where like if I make eye contact with you, <laughs> like I kind of, kind of like, like nine. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But I was, I was nervous. So I was just like, and just, <laughs> and just close the door fast behind me. <laughs> just started walking down the middle of the street. Wow, like, dude, this that is like crazy. five o'clock in the middle of the day. Like oh, it's, wow. I remember going outside. It's so bright outside. Yeah. I think it's probably summertime. Yeah. Or like get right, into right, right, get right, into yeah, somewhere, yeah. bro. But it like <laughs> he just said, "I wonder who." <laughs> I just I, I couldn't not look. Bro. Yeah, <laughs> it was yeah. Like, no, I, saw, I'm glad I peeked you did. the TV, yeah, yeah. and when I saw her sitting back with her feet, <laughs> like looking back at me, it was it was just shock. Like it was just like, "What the fuck?" That shit probably didn't nobody feel real. said nothing. Yeah. It just, it just walked out. All right, do you remember what a vagina looked like in your head? Before you ever saw one? That's a good question. Like, before I ever saw yeah, speaking one. To you. Yeah. Before I ever saw one ever? Like. A vagina, yeah. Before I ever seen porn or anything like that. Uh, yeah. yeah. Like, before you ever saw, like, literally a vagina. Like, in your head, probably as a kid or however yeah, old you were. I, I don't know what I imagined it. Really? Like, yeah, I cannot remember. Yeah, how about you? I just, I mean like, what well, I, I think from memory, bro. I I think I remember thinking, it's just like, like I could draw it. You know what I mean? Like yeah. just the line and like the. Uh, but that's it. I just remember like a line, but I don't remember uh, nothing. Like literally nothing else. Damn, I was dumb as fuck then. Why? Because at least you had the line down, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I used to fake the funk like a motherfucker. Like <laughs> what? I don't know. As a kid, I was just lying, like a, like lying about experiences and shit. Yeah. Because yeah. I wanted to be hip and be with the group and shit. Uh, so there's this big Mexican kid named Kenneth, who was he was just like a bigger kid than everybody else. Mm-hmm. So he kind of ran and shit. He was already watching the porns and shit. And we were young, young. This was back when I was in my apartments. I would say probably before 12. Okay. So between probably like 9 to 12, right? Okay. He's talking about like these pornos and shit and like people getting fucked and whatnot. Damn. And I I just remember, I don't know why we was having these conversations. It's just like a little like badass kids. Just yeah, being yeah, like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, vaginas and fucking yeah, pussies. Yeah, like some shit, yeah. Yeah, so... Uh, he's describing like the sex and stuff, and outwardly, I'm just like, oh yeah, yeah, that's that's the stuff, <laughs> that's the stuff, that's the stuff I like right there. Yeah, vagina and vagina yeah, pussy. Yeah. That's me. <laughs> that's that you call me vagina, vagina pussy. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> In my household, <laughs> but yeah. um, so. As we're like we're talking about it, you know, shooting the shit with the boys, <laughs> um, I'm drawing a picture in my head, bro, of like what I think off mm. of this nigga's sort of descri- like description. And for me, it was the nastiest thing ever, bro. <laughs> I pretty much pictured damn near like two booty holes. <laughs> just, like I picture That's what cute. an asshole is, but almost more just open circle just an open circle hole yeah just like a little clamping hole like a like yeah, yeah, yeah. smooth no, 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 and yeah. then just a hole right like a there barbie doll just yeah but then just like drill. a circle hole just like right there just nothing around and at the time i didn't even think it was like under there yeah because now i know it's kind of under them you know like they could be naked damn near and then nothing really be showing mm-hmm I thought it was like right here, bro. Like damn near, Shit. Like, like under the belly, belly button. Like oh, under the like fuck. probably like seven inches under the belly button is where I'm thinking. Like it just start right there. So I think you could almost like walk into it, like frontwards, <laughs> bro. 
Yeah, I don't know what it was for me. It was just it was just the whole. That's fucking terrifying. Though. I used to yeah, be, I, used I wasn't enjoying yeah, this at the time. I used to be scared of nipples. Like yeah. women's nipples? Yeah, that shit terrifying me. Scared like how? There was one movie I watched about this like species of aliens, right? And and but they're like they look like humans, right? It was a horror movie. Okay, so I'm little watching. I'm probably like maybe nine, ten years old. I'm watching this, right? And there was a scene because everybody was watching it, like my uncle and them. They had walked out for some reason, right? So I'm over here playing. So I'm like, what the fuck's going on TV? I go ahead look. In this in this scene, uh, the dude removed the girl's bra, right? And she had mm. these nipples. And he goes to I didn't I didn't nipples. know yeah I didn't know at the time but he went to, like, <laughs> he had went yeah. to like go like suck on him right and but and I'm a kid I think he's just gonna go look at him so I <laughs> I look at him too I zoom in with my face on TV I'm like what yeah. the hell and her nipples are actually like these like little fucking like alien versus predator mouths that fucking stick out like they got teeth on them and they fucking like eat his face or his, his eyeballs some shit like oh, that bro fuck. these nipples are like. Fucking killers, you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. And after that, I just fucking ran away. I knew I shouldn't have been watching that. I didn't ask nobody nothing about that shit. I was just like, man, fucking nipples are goddamn dangerous. We need to stay away from them. You know, so I, that shit used to hella cool me off. defense mechanism. Yeah, that shit hella cool me off because I was fucking terrified of that shit, bro. Yeah, I guess that's really... That's, yeah, why'd you, why'd you ask, I guess? Because it's just what, like... like what I made up in my head, mm. and it was a big deal at the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was like I was probably just, like I probably thought I was thinking and walking. I was probably just staring <laughs> into the ceiling, just yeah. brain dead, and staring at the bad. sun and crying. I remember at our apartments we used to have like those little BB guns. We had BB guns, mm. like and had these BB gun wars and shit like that. Yeah. The thing about it, that shit was like an operation, bro, because we had an older kid who would buy them, and. Like, mm. took his parents' money. He was smuggling them to the rest of the kids and shit like that, oh, right? Damn. I was known for fixing the BB guns, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I was, like, the one taking them apart. Like, if your shit was acting up, I have this little rock, right? Because there's a, it's a blue apartment, right? You got the, like, the kids' playground here, right? And then over to it, there's, like, this little tree. It was, like, a little berry bush. Fuck berry bushes, by the way. A little berry bush, a tree over, right? So it created shade. There was a little rock I used to have, right? That was like my workbench, you know what I mean? So if anybody caught us, oh, we were right next to the to the park. We just wanted some shade, right? Hilariously enough, I think I was about nine, ten years old here too. <laughs> Guys, stay away from nipples. <laughs> Use these for nipples. Yeah, yeah. But anyway, so yeah, they would bring me... Um, it's so funny, dude, because I, I had a BB gun myself, bro, because you can't be working on... You know what yeah, I mean? You got to, yeah. you know. So yeah, they used to bring me and my to like... I don't know, bro. I don't know why, but I used to be able to take them apart and like fix the springs and shit like that. Oh, the springs fucked up. You need the new one and shit. I used to have spare parts. I had a whole operation, bro. A whole operation, parts. right? Yeah. Just like with the little kids. The big kids, you know, they knew how to do their shit. The little ones didn't, right? Yeah. Or my age, I should say. And, bro, this one time I fucked up. Bro. One time I fucked up bad, bro. Because I had gotten two. I, just people come out like lines, right? I got two at one time, right? This guy had wanted me to watch his BB gun while he went inside, right? And this other kid wanted me to fix his, right? So I had mm. a functioning one, and then I had a bad one, right? And I said, okay, cool. Just leave me, you know, I'll figure this yeah. shit out, you know? Put, just put a fucking few little hot Cheetos right here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Some fucking Capri Suns. Out yeah, of my shop. Yeah. yeah. And he gave me them, right? And I, I don't know why I get sidetracked, but I end up giving the the kid mm. right with the broken gun i gave him the other dude's uh, bb gun yeah yeah i gave him his, the other dude's strap right which is you're not supposed to do that no, right no. especially at my shop with my reputation i was like i'll never make it out of this <laughs> <laughs> but i gave it to him right and then the dude come back and he was like this is not mine i was like what the fuck you mean it's not your he said no mine had like a little scratch right here you know because mm. if you knew your yeah. shit yeah. this one's like clean smooth you know and it looks like something's fucked up in this, right? So I look at it, and that BB gun, bro, it's like you put the BBs in, and it doesn't like, it's supposed to hold the, the clip in, but for some reason, the BBs like come out the barrel. Like, mm, if it's, if you point, out. it just falls out, right? Mm. So you can't really fix those, at least yeah. in my experience. Yeah. If, if y'all know, yeah. <laughs> I, I I'm used to like springs and like clips not fully sticking yeah. in, but just falling out. I was like, I needed more time with it, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we was having a BB gun war at the time, bro. I'm talking like 
the kids from the upper side of the fucking uh, apartments, kids from the back side, right? North and South. Exactly. We had a fucking war going on, right? I just sent this kid with the fucking BB gun that works. He's over there with some bushes. He's like, fa, 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 fa. It's gonna work screen. Fa, 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 right? <laughs> Thanks, Marco. <laughs> Credits. To- and dude, I fucking have to, like, I go around, right? I, I come, bro, I, I low key kind of sneak behind this dude. I tap him on the shoulder. Hey, bro. <laughs> I know it's not a good time, bro. Listen, that's not your BB gun. That's Derek's BB gun, and he wants it back, and I need to give it back to him. So, <laughs> I, I give him his fucked up BB gun, bro. I was nice enough. It had it had like a loaded clip, bro, but as he's holding it, aiming it down, you just see all the BBs fall out the goddamn barrel. And I just had to like fucking walk away from it, bro. In the middle of war, bro. This guy's getting his fucking shot at. I don't know what it was, bro, but I feel so confident doing that. And I just, yeah, I returned the gun and I don't know, bro. You had to make it right, bro. Yeah, he probably sustained a heavy injury because I've never seen him playing again, bro. Well, thank you guys for tuning in to another amazing episode of the Flybug Podcast. Thank you. Like, comment, subscribe. subscribe. Bring that bell notification. Uh, yeah, make sure you guys share that, uh, this episode, anything we do. We're on Facebook, kind of. We're on Instagram mainly, and we're on TikTok mainly. So go ahead, follow us at those channels. Uh, HR, do you have anything to say? Happy Lunar New Year. Peace. Have a great night.